I haven't traveled as much as you have. So we get to the airport, and Hertz is usually our go-to. The Hertz, uh, although, even though Hertz never has my name up on the thing, ever. It's never <laughs> happened. It doesn't matter. It's like 11 at night, whatever. Well, it ends up, I don't know, we're in the air, and we get a text. Yep. Hertz doesn't have any cars, so you're going to have to go to Avis. Beautiful Avis. So we're like, okay, well, we're going to go to Avis. That's what's going to happen. What, what do we say? Like, We're at 30,000 feet. We're captive. So it's ve very clear that all of these rental car companies are going through bankruptcy because they're a disaster. It is. They don't know what they're doing. Yep. So we land in Kentucky, and we go to the part of the airport where you wait for the rental car vans to pick you up and then drive you to the rental car Place. It's off site. Exactly. Now in Kentucky, Cincinnati, the rental car places are not in one big building together like they would be in Seattle or, you know, whatever. Dallas. Yeah. Any other major metro airport. They're, they're spread out. So they have at the airport, they have like, this is where you wait for the Avis shuttle. This is where you wait for the dollar shuttle. This is where you wait for, you know, whatever shuttle. And this is where you wait for the Hertz shuttle. So we get there, and there's no Avis shuttle. No. And so I'm like, so should I call Avis? And you're like, I don't know. <laughs> you were no as help. Usual, as usual, no, no help. help at all. So I, I look at the calendar invite, and it has a phone number. So I'm like, okay, I'm going to call. So I call, and nobody answers. Like nothing, 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 nothing. Then all of a sudden, the Hertz van shows up, and this guy's an entrepreneur. Genius. Genius. He says, he parks in the Hertz thing, which I don't know, is what, 50 yards away. Yep. But he yells, have you guys been waiting for Avis long? And we're like, well, kind of, but not really. Like, I don't know. We'd like waited five minutes. minutes. Yeah. Yeah. Well, no, because I called. It, okay, so maybe five minutes, five probably. Minutes. Yeah. We're like, um, and he goes, yeah, something about they never come or something. I don't know. Like something. <laughs> and he says, um, I'll take you there. And we're like, Okay. Us and a bunch of people, because clearly um, a bunch of people were going to Avis because Hertz was out of cars. Out of cars. Yep. So this guy, think about it. This, this shuttle driver is out of cars. They have no cars. He's got no work. He's got a family to feed. He's got a family to feed. And so he's picking up Avis customers because he knows Avis sucks. And their shuttle comes by once an hour. He does, they don't pick up the phone, whatever, right? So we get in the Hertz thing, and immediately Christian and I are like, oh, we got to tip this yeah, guy, so right? Both dig it. Not just us, though. Everybody on the van. Yeah, so I'm like, the tips. I'm, um, so I like, I flash Christian. I'm like, hey, I got a 20. I'm going to take care of him. Did you tip him also? No. Because I, um, you had money yeah, in your yeah, hand. I was going to give him a five. You were going to give him a five. Yep. So I gave him a 20 just because I was so impressed that this guy – has like he could be sitting at Hertz going, oh, we're out of cars. Yep. With How his feet make up. Any money? But he's like, he's showing some ambition and um, clearly knows that there's a gap in the marketplace because Avis doesn't know what the hell they're doing. Yep. Thanks so much for watching this clip of Service Driver Revolution. We're uploading new stuff every day, so make sure you subscribe and click the bell icon so you don't miss out. If you have a question you'd like us to answer on the show, Call 8333-ASK-SDR and we'll answer your question on the show. That's 8333-ASK-SDR. For special deals on our books and training, head over to offers.chriscollinsinc.com. Now that's offers.chriscollinsinc.com. I'm Chris Collins and I'll see you in the next video.